Well, Brad and Erica, good evening. Yeah, school leaders canceled graduation this afternoon, and late tonight they sent out a Facebook post to all parents, bringing them up to date, saying that they've identified the juvenile who sent these threatening posts both over the weekend and earlier today. He lives in Joliet, more than 30 miles from Summit, and has no connection to the school here in, Far in Argo. Senior Rachel Alber and her mom walking away from Argo Community High School. Rachel, like so many others, were supposed to walk across the stage and graduate. But tonight's commencement canceled as Summit Police keep watch out front. There's a huge sense of frustration, you know, and again, you think back to your own graduation and what a wonderful celebratory time it was. I had seen it on Sunday going around on Snapchat before it became like a school wide announcement. Elber is talking about this Snapchat post threatening to shoot every class at Argo. I want the best thing for my daughter. I want the best thing for these kids, and I believe the school has has taken that into consideration. The juvenile student who made the threat was identified and arrested Monday, but today the school was placed on a soft lockdown after additional threats were made, causing the school to postpone graduation. The last few days has been hectic. Akila Shelby's family traveled from all over to see her son Quincy graduate. I think they made an excellent decision. Um, I just think that they should have made it maybe like sooner. At this point, they could just mail me my diploma. A horrible joke to make if it even is a joke and a threat is a threat. Tonight, the school sending a Facebook message telling parents the threat was not viable and a reminder to talk about the dangers of social media with their kids. And I don't want my daughter looking back and telling her kids, yeah, you know, when I graduated, you know, there was a gun threat. Now, charges are pending against that juvenile in Joliet. As for graduation, it has been is going to be rescheduled. No date has been set. We are live in Summit. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News, Brad and Erica. Okay, Charlie, thank you.